We've been working on a number of integrations to make it easier for users to securely transfer the information they need between UpGuard and other applications. UpGuard has powerful in-app workflows to assist you with your third-party vendor management. But some of our customers have particular parts of the process that they want to push as a task into a different system they use to manage their work. For many of our customers, this is Jira. As a result, we have launched a native Jira integration that makes it simple to push events from UpGuard into any Jira project. This Jira integration plugs directly into your workflow management, giving you the flexibility to present only the information you want to the relevant people to address security risks promptly. All this can be done quickly and easily. Let me show you how it works. To begin receiving notifications within Jira from the UpGuard platform, I need to first connect UpGuard to my Atlassian account and authorize access. To do this, I'll navigate to the Integrations tab within Settings and select New Integration. From the list of options, I'll select Jira Cloud. I'll need to select my workspace if required and click Accept. Once done, my UpGuard account is connected to Jira Cloud and I'm ready to create an integration. Now that the connection has been made, I can create Jira Cloud notifications. I'll do this with four simple steps. The first step is to set up the triggers. This will enable me to identify the triggers I would like to integrate. For this example, I've chosen to enable notifications for when my company's score drops below 600 and for when my VIP identity has been breached. Once I've selected my triggers, I'll click Confirm and Next. Then I'll create a name for my integration and set a destination. Here, the destination allows me to select the Jira Cloud project I wish to integrate with. Once this has been done, I'll click Confirm and Next. Next, I'll review the content. This is where I get to customize my issue creation and the messaging. To do this, I'll select the nominated trigger on the left-hand side panel to ensure that I have selected the correct project and then choose the issue type. This will then display a variety of other fields which are custom to my particular Jira instance or project. There's a set of default upgrade variables I can use to customize the integration. I can click the copy icon on the right-hand side of each row to copy the variable to use in my Jira issue. The variables here are extremely flexible, so I can easily customize my Jira integration as I see fit. In this example, I've chosen to create a task from an UpGuard notification, and I've opted to leave the default wording in the summary and description fields. Once I've done this, I can then view a simulation of the issue creation. Here, I can find the other custom attributes that I've set up for my Jira project and a button to test create issue. When I click on this, the Jira issue will populate into my backlog or wherever my standard issue creation regularly occurs for my review. The final step is to enable my new integration. I can then find my new integration in the integrations tab within the settings, which can be enabled or disabled, as well as edited or deleted. The Jira Cloud integration provides a quick and easy process to push events and notifications from UpGuard to a Jira project of your choice. This saves you time by helping you quickly create Jira issues, prioritize and assign them to the relevant person. So security risks and other relevant events in the UpGuard system can be investigated or remediated as soon as possible. This feature is now available for all UpGuard customers. If you have any questions, please ask them in the Q&A or contact support at upguard.com. Now I'm going to hand it over to Chris to demo remediation requests within risk assessments.